<laughs> Hola totas. Welcome to Spawny Adventure. Dos. Hello. Bloody Cadiz. Oh, ben, ben, benvenido. Oh, yeah. I was getting ready to do animation changes, but. Bernard didn't need oh, to. All Mediterranean peoples are this air. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Who would like to do a spontaneous advertisement for the uh, uh, Gabagool or Tequila? Or both? Hello. It's, it's summer coming to Spain. It's Gabagool. <laughs> <laughs> Put it on your dog. Put it on your sandwich. Eat it upside down. Gabagool <laughs> doesn't care. And don't forget, proper Paul Brazil Tequila. There's a lot of fakes out there, so don't get Gabba fooled, get Gabba goo. <laughs> oh my god. There you go. Yeah, there's our advertisement from our sponsor. Oh, this number! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I should have put a fake phone number on it. One, one, eight, we, nine, we, nine, we, need, nine, we need like a Freddy eight, Freaker eight, on eight, like nine, 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 to look nine, like one, one, nine, seven, two, five. But, but yeah. Eight. I should put a real phone number on there and just not say whose number it is. <laughs> Call 555. Yeah. I want some Gabagool right now. Please, give it to me. We'll put past this phone number on it so that he keeps getting a bunch of calls from the Gabagool. Gosh. <laughs> well, at least I can right. tell him yeah. to find something tequila. I'm, I'm dumping something in Ramshore game. We need oh. this, but reskinned as Remy. Oh. This this whole commercial. Ah, come on, why did you not work yourself? Uh, oh, I just Happy looked at it and it says, yeah, that's all. Glamour shot. There we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> we need that, but it's just Remy. <laughs> One, four, nine, oh, no. <laughs> we'll ask Ritualist. <laughs> all right. The thing is about to probably dead. animate that, to be fair. <laughs> so, yeah, all you can do is rotoscope <laughs> over it, or just, yeah. It's, it's just T-posing the whole time, just bobbing up and down. Oh my god. Yeah. The, uh... Full the, frame gif. The intro yeah. is about to end, so we'd like to do a recap. Oh, well, here's a another recap. thing before we get into that. Are we getting extra XP at the end of this session, because we missed the last session? Ah, that might be a reason for that, yeah. Oh... Yeah. Completely not that I was experimenting with a different mate of giving out XP, but okay. <laughs> you might get flooded with XP. Okay, last time we went to the capital. Uh, Will tried to go to the capital before us, didn't quite work out. Um, we talked to people in the throne room, uh, did some intrigue, you know, learned things, all that shit. And then we'll uh, be paid, uh, the queen came in. We all pressed. F um, what's the praise instead of respect? Is there a mean for that? You pressed E to interact. Press e to there you go. Or e, e to interact or P to praise. <laughs> yeah. We upvoted the queen. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. We, we hit. We all hit Control Six. Yeah. Or Shift we did Six. That. Yeah, Shift Six. Okay. Eventually, passed the gun audience. Queen, all was cool and chill. And then Will burst in like. Ah, I have an urgent <laughs> message for the queen. And uh, the guards grabbed him because it was a bit... He's got a call. gun! He rushed yeah, the basically. queen. <laughs> yeah. Basically came in like, This man is a liar! And then they just saw that. Wait, this man has a gun! <laughs> Stop him! <laughs> yeah, he, he had a gun on him. Uh, the guards took him to an alleyway to process him, I guess, for... Which sounds like the one trade federation we're going to do in Star Wars. Right, <laughs> yes, sir. Um, process him from to be a living a person bit. into a not living person. <laughs> he kind of does, obvious. like, process them into Gabagool or something. <laughs> <laughs> this, audience, this audience with the Queen is getting out of control. Now there's two of them! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Anyway, they beat the I'm fuck out of him for a bit. Will freaked out because he thought he was going to die, so he flame flame attacked them all, which was pretty badass, I guess. <laughs> and that's when things got knocked into 12th gear. Yep. Remy was like, run into the slums with me, bro, or whatever, and get him out of the city. Um, 
everyone else was like, what the fuck happened? I don't know, let's just carry on with the life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, let Paul will escape from New York. Uh, well, escape from uh, <laughs> um Escape from Tesco. <laughs> escape from Tesco. <laughs> 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 Well, we we got the news that uh oh, you want a siege? There's what? Then a clan of just fucking there's what? There's what? There's what? There's what? There's the rest of the party got official sports siege this this dude near the lakes, and they're on their way to lay siege to him. I think while there's Remy's me. back in the city with with Will's character, and I think that's it. I think that's the recap. More or less. Don't speak too loudly around the, the newly elected Pope, or suddenly he'll call a crusade. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's, my, my, that's the lesson I learned. <laughs> well, you know, if you're the new Pope, you want an easy win. <clears throat> Look, don't you come to me on the day of my crusade. Who do you want a crusade? I think it's an ordination. Could but... we do the main party first and then come back to me and Will? If he doesn't show up, we'll just. I'll just hand it, I'll wrap it on myself or whatever. Yeah, so. I, I might do that because uh, that might be a bit of an issue that he's not here. Uh, he might show up. I don't know. He's not answered me at all. Yeah, we've all messaged him individually, so. So I think he he's walking back, the dog. There's no way he can miss. So yeah. give him, get, we'll, we'll yeah. do party party one and then we'll do the side party. Yeah. When he gets back. Okay. So. I'm number one. Fortunately, I have a pony, so I could probably get. You could probably just bail on him. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Gabagool pony, mm -hmm. Gabagool pony. <laughs> oh god. You should make a pony out of Gabagool. Yeah. Hmm. Horse meat so good. Oh my god. So we return to deep within the uh, Nevoir Forest, where we've uh, you find yourselves at the encampment. There you Yay. go. Ah, excellent. You may. Join the meeting at the table, <laughs> or not? <laughs> Where's the table? <laughs> can... I'm imagining that camp in fucking Skyrim, where it's like you go up to what's her face, the Nord Lady, and she's like, <laughs> you know, well, soldier, are you ready for this mission? That, right, that's literally what this, this is. Yeah, yeah. The table there. <laughs> <laughs> and it's just the like, now. Fuck off. Yeah. Okay, I see. Okay, I can yeah, see the table. They're, they're all like standing the around. Mission, the table. If you choose to accept it, is to yeah. go win. Yeah. High five. If you wish, you may also join the big pile of bodies instead. Done. Mm -hmm. I mean, Espacho is using that as the toilet, but otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's the big pile of scouts. Oh. The enemy scouts. Oh, your scouts are became even more like <laughs> that's, that's the scout. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Ash is very good at drawing kawaii. Um, yeah. <laughs> which isn't helpful because I don't have a charisma character. <laughs> it's more funny that way. Yeah. Your character's good looking but has no social. Oh, you've updated the art again. <laughs> yep. Uh, let me make it bigger a second. <laughs> I Armor did. made from leaves. Yeah, I, I I leave the art in the um, the animation art the same one for the moment. Yeah, I say that my picture's the same. It's just the token is different. Oh, okay, cool, cool. I like how you were able to do it on your own. I didn't need to do it. Um, they've updated yeah, how that works. It's, That's it's actually really convenient. nice. Yeah, I just was like update token, and it was like righto. Yep. Cool. Right, you find yourselves. In the middle of, well, at the edge of Never Wood, overlooking the uh, the town of I forget the name Navarre. Hobgoblinton. Hobgoblinton. I do believe Nevar. I think it is Nevar. Yeah, Will said yeah. he'd be with us in a minute. Unprecedented amounts of yep. racism. Yep. The. Uh, the boys have been uh, constructing some trebuchets and a, and a ram. Uh, Excellent. I'm playing Rome's whole war. <laughs> well, was there anything you would like them to add, like to build as well? Hmm. Build a siege tower. <laughs> yeah, it was You're not a siege tower, but I reckon maybe the um, crusade is coming with that. No, it's right there. Rome's on his way. It's right there. <laughs> Oh dear. 
Hello, Siege Tower. Yeah. Looking tall today. The only issue is Nevoir has a river around it. All around it? Yeah. You might be able to use it as like a mobile um, command position, so you can see out over the battle easier. Easier. <laughs> Push the tower Hello. closer. I want to hit them. The <laughs> I want to see what's going on. I can't see from all the way back here. <laughs> but one must be aware of the arches. In fact, you probably could put arches in the tower. Put your sniper in there. <laughs> Brett, fifty k. <cal> <laughs> <laughs> It's a shame I can't actually have a plan for to make this siege a lot easier. <laughs> you just send spec cops into the gatehouse at three in the morning and open the gate, and then your army floods in. So just like the Capitol yeah. building, gotcha. Yeah. Hola, señores. Hola. I'll give you the old crack you a salute. I see you have been productive. Yep, we uh, got started. The main camp is off, off screen here to the to the west. There's a nice little fort built around it because uh, Cole can do that. I see. Yeah, there's also a mo Sorry. mobile uh, hospital, which Frankie has set up. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Well, if you peek out over the. Uh, the crates over here next to Espacho, you can see the uh, enemy camp down the hill. They're trying to keep as quiet as possible so they don't get, you know, everything figured out what they're going to do. Wait, the enemy has uh, camped outside its own fortress? Oh no, the enemy fort is down the hill. Ah, like the excellent. actual town is down the hill. They're trying okay, to... Let's... They're try Basically, they're trying to, like, keep as much of what they're doing secret as possible. We're we're discussing our invasion of of speed from the back of a giant speeder in the edge of the woods. This is what's going on. Right now. Yep. Yeah. Um, Cole so will hand you I... a little telescope if you want to have a peek. Uh, we can have a little peek. Oh, you want to have a peek? All right. Without the gun, right? They'll be totally helpless. Here. That's pretty much what you can see from the uh, your current position. I see. Wait a minute. What's that? Uh, can you ping again? Oh, um, sure. Yep. Oh, uh, is that Ben or Skog pinging? That was me going You're like similar colors. Bing who? Yeah, mm -hmm. the guy is shaking his fist at you, <laughs> and he's got he's got a uh, Cole's he's got our or not Cole uh, Zan's wife. <laughs> he's got her there. Oh, okay. He's like showing her off, letting you know that she's here. Hmm. Yeah, uh, over here, Fasta. Those are yes. some war riders. I see. Hmm. It's Bachel. Do you reckon you could uh, stir some trouble with the work right? <laughs> Send to the drone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, I think I could do something with that. The more chaos we have, the the more hopefully we can get the work riders without their mounts. Yeah. Hopefully. I think I could do a thing or two with that. Excellent. Well, Spacho starts like digging through his little tiny bag of tricks. Mm -hmm. Who's the big man? It appears to be some big cunt. <laughs> He's just like watching you. Hmm. Fair enough. Well, it He's... seems we're expected. He's just peeing in the river. <laughs> not, not breaking <laughs> eye contact. <laughs> Fists on hips. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he currently has his hands occupied. <laughs> it seems we are very much expected. Yeah. Hmm. They know you're there. They just don't know how no, much no, many numbers you have, and or how many uh, 
like what you're doing in here in the trees. I see. Yeah. You get that impression well, at least. Even though hey, Frankie. E? Hey, Frankie. E? Do you think you uh, you could maybe find a few more of your, I don't know, people in this group who could help us uh, find some poison in the woods or something? Hmm. I have some to work with, but we'll we find some like hemlock or something that might actually really help out a lot. That might be a Did good idea. You're not here, Will. <laughs> <laughs> Did somebody say poison? <laughs> Somebody yeah. say poison. Frankie's gonna grab two of the goblins and then head off looking for uh, poison. As Pacho's gonna join them on that. Yeah. Offer help. Yeah. Would you like to roll a nature check? <laughs> While I try and frighten Frankie. I'll character. try. <laughs> I don't exactly have good nature. I think try. Frankie does. I don't remember. It's been like a year since I met Frankie. Can I, can I use the help action to give Frankie advantage. Yes, you can. All right. I'll Once do her that. sheet loads, because the page is completely white right now. <laughs> that page oh. has no culture. All Everything right. is broken. Everything sucks when you're running a game. See. It's like it just waits for you to be running a game for it to break. Oh yeah, yeah, that happens to me every time we try to run. I very much know that feel. So. Like, roll 20 is not working at all. Like, it's not responding to anything I'm doing. Yeah. Great. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, mm -hmm. it's catching uh up. Oh. Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay. I see. I was just double checking I didn't accidentally leave a PDF open, which would kill everything. <laughs> Hey, hey, Erica, hey, Erica, we're gonna go find some poison. Do you wanna, do you wanna find poison with us? It sounds like fun, right? I suppose, yes, I shall go. We run some little circle. We. Would you like to make a, uh, a nature check? A nature check, yeah. Um, I have zero for nature, so we'll see how this goes. Frankie got a 22. <laughs> And I got a nat one. No. Frankie just does all the work. <laughs> yeah, I'm just Her, standing Erica there bleeding. Like, <laughs> she like turns around Erica and you're like chewing on grass. She found poison. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like just trying to throw up. <laughs> oh god. Just I'm plucking blades of grass and holding it out to her like, is this poison? <laughs> no. And then I grab a leaf. Is this poison? <laughs> She, she finds three three uh three vials of hemlock for you uh Gaspacho. All right, I will add that to my list. Ingestion poison. Yep. Is there any other uh, preparation Thanks, you would like to uh to do? That's, uh, that's my prep for yep. Spacho's business shenanigans. She will hand you an ointment to pass on to uh, Hector. If you don't okay. already have one, you can hold on to it. But if you, you do, just pass it on to Hector. Yeah, that's good. Thank you. Yep. Fair, fair. Ointment. You do you need this, Spacho? No, it's for you, man. Okay, Keep it somewhere where I can find it real quick if I have to stuff it in you, though. Like I did the last time. <laughs> you put it on people, it's, it says do not ingest on the back in big red letters. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. See, thank you for stuff that. Stuff it into the wound, that's not quite ingesting. <laughs> that's inserting. Very different. Fair enough. Right. Ask your mom. Hey, anyway. <laughs> 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 Alright. <clears throat> Is there anything anyone else would like to do? Uh, see, I uh, have a little something to share with uh, the rest of you. Uh. So, 
we might be joined by a few more uh, people than I expected. Um, this is no longer just a siege. Gentlemen, welcome to the crusade. Yay. <laughs> Uh... As you say that, you hear off in the distance like trumpets blaring and drums beating. <laughs> There's like an entire away. like Spanish army has arrived to the south of the town. <laughs> they sent everyone. <laughs> Thunderbirds are coming. Yes. Um, <laughs> turns out the. Going to meet the queen, talking about a siege while the new pope is looking for something to uh, bite his teeth into. Um, what well, does the new well, pope? Who's the pope? See, um, I forget his name. It's um, I do believe it's um, the chaos queen's son. No. Oh, just like her to elect your son as the pope. <laughs> Let's see. Well, in any case, we have a lot of support. Um, son, you might uh, have a bit of a dilemma, however, uh, with <laughs> things, unless they convert. Well. Believe all preparations are ready to go. Excellent. Well. Let's see, what other armies have uh, arrived, save for those who came straight from Cadiz? Well, there's the uh, the winged lizards over to the east. They kind of point them out in the distance. Disregard the, the winged lizards. They doesn't appear to be anyone in command, though, because they're like <laughs> licking trees and whatnot over there. <laughs> there's, <laughs> there's like um, no order at all. <laughs> well, um... Let's just say, um, I think we can write off the winged lizards. I think, um, be cautious of them and, um, well, if uh, we get a lot more support than we thought, um, pick them off, maybe? Very good. They, um, well, Let's just say the gentleman I called in for a favor to uh, have them here, he uh, turned his coat. He's no longer uh, on our side. Hmm. See. Si. You mean the lizard man? See. Si. Do there was something wrong with him? Despacho. How are you with uh, fire newts? Well, I mean, I scared the piss out of them last time we met them. Okay, I'm going to leave it up to you. Um, do you want to sow discord within the siege? Or do you want to try to take command of some fire notes? Ah, uh, man. What kind of question is that? I'm going to go for people in the town. I fear. I'm going to go prison stuff. <laughs> I don't want to leave. Oh, He's just standing okay. there with like a couple of vials of poison under his arms. <laughs> and you're like, do you want to go over there? And like, no. <laughs> yeah, he's like, unless you want me to just put that dead weight over there by killing them all. I don't have any, I don't have anything I want to do with those guys. No, if we're going to kill them, we might as well do it together. I made Make them the beat themselves activity. a better impression last time we met. I mean, we don't have a whole lot of caliber with them, you know? They're useless. As you're, as you're chatting, you guys here, killed the whole town of them just by yourself. As you're, as I wasn't you're, even there. as you're chatting, oh. you hear the distance of barking. Barking? Yeah. What's this? Yeah. If you have a peek over, you'll see that there's a unit of uh, uh, work riders riding out to the northeast. Seven men. Hmm. Northeast. The, you can ah. still see that other unit by the by the lake, but it was a different one that has moved out. You get the impression that the message you had sent ahead via your uh, vampire companion I see might have gotten to them, i.e. send troops north. Let's see, 
which means less troops in the town. Gentlemen, let's pull out for a bit. Yeah, you start to see I... then a bunch of uh, guys marching out. There's at least a hundred of them. I think we might be getting a bit of resistance. That is to say, um, I might have uh, arranged for uh, some of them to depart the city before we start. Well, that's convenient, boss. See, knowing people in high places uh, tends to uh, help you. Which hopefully means uh, when they return, they might be uh, safe. <laughs> Which means you might have more people uh, alive. As you say that, you hear some people. screams and uh, um, hissing. What is this coming from? Are you going to peek out and see what's happening? Let's see. Yeah, the wing lizards <laughs> may have fucking charged it on them. <laughs> well... Um, I guess we don't have to beat them off. <clears throat> um, somebody is doing that job for us. Well, gentlemen, I suppose um, let's take a few hours for a reprieve, get ready, and uh, we approach through the forest. I'd say, based on how many armies we have, have the Sanchez troops arrived? Hi, they're at the main camp. Excellent. The, uh, your your wife is here. Help. She's been leading them. Let's see. In fact, there's like three of them over there. Oh, there's some here too. Excellent. I assume the same with the uh, new addition of Chartus, the old Chartus, and the mercenaries. Okay. I'd say if we take the old sharp tooths and the mercenaries into one troop, the Sanchez troops and the new additions to the sharp tooths in another. Um, Call. I'd say lead the old sharp tooths. Lydia, lead the new sharp tooths and the Sanchez troops. We have approach from two fronts on that one. And. Uh, is John Verona leading his own troops, or yep. he, he's over between you and the main Spanish army? I see. Don Verona will be providing backup. Put Let's it this see. way: you could probably use the Spanish army <laughs> as a distraction. <laughs> Good point. Yes, I think we'll. Uh... Wait for a while. Let the crusade take the first uh, stab at uh, the approach. Remain the cavalry. Try to limit our losses. See? Very good, sir. Excellent. Well, gentlemen. Time to find a place to lay down and wait. Mm-hmm. The Baron will turn to you and say, uh, Don Hector, si. you may have overlooked something. Tell me then, what yeah. have I overlooked? We've built all these siege equipment, but we forgot to bring engineers. <laughs> Very good point. I guess we'll have to learn on the job. Well, no, 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 no. I have an alternative. Who wants to bring this uh, this siege equipment over to the uh, Spanish troops? <laughs> the goblins who just assembled everything just look so dejected right now. <laughs> okay. Not you. Uh, you. <laughs> Good uh, large lads. I, I reckon you've been uh, resting, preparing yourselves. Bring it over and uh, we'll keep resting for a bit. See? Alright then. We have to outlet our uh, energy one way or another. So you want to give all the siege equipment to the Spanish? Yes, presented as a 
gift, I suppose. Yeah. Considering they are taking the first approach, it's probably for the better. All things considered. All right. Then we can just sally forth after them, I reckon. You're giving them the everything? The ram, the uh, trebuchets, and the tower? Let's keep the siege tower, actually. So you can um, see what's happening. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, that and potentially four archers. Yep. Let's give them the trebuchets and the battering ram. Cool. All right. Yes. Cool. So, if that is everything... See, we, I do believe so. We shall return to Remy and El Tannen, who have snuck oh my God, back into low. Spain. Or oh. into Clinton. Hey, pal, where's this uh, Elven boy who knows about the dragon? Oh my god. We'll I can't remember. He said somewhere at the docks, didn't he, or something like that? I don't know. Uh, do, do we know where we would meet some ghosts? <laughs> He's right there. Oh my god. He's right here. Yeah, look, he's right there. You're at the docks. Uh -huh. Yay. Yeah. Well, yep. hola, senors. We, we shall approach him, anime yeah. and all that. Yeah. He approaches <laughs> you and is like, hola, oh. senors. I'll shake hey, his hand and pal? say greetings. <laughs> so, this information you said you had about a white dragon. Ah, see. What do you know about the white dragon? That he exists, and he is north of here, but I'm not sure how far north of here. Mm -hmm. That's all I know. I have been tasked with uh, uh, finding him. I'm trying to remember his name. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> ah, there it is. Uh, the dragon, his name, he is Thothmir. Okay. You say Thothmir? Thothmir. Okay. Thothmir. Okay. Yeah. Write down. You want to write it down? Yeah. Copy, yep. paste. Thothmir. Mm. You can, can we find him in White oh, and Scar. Kill list. White Drago. Yeah. Yep. Be warned though, there is a uh, a tribe of frost giants that adopted him as a wormling and uh, continue to uh, see him as a uh, protector of their clan. Uh huh. So, uh, how many frost giants we're talking? I'm an academic. I don't know. I don't. They don't often climb into the mountains to <laughs> check out yeah, random tribes in the full, fucking wilderness. There's probably a full tribe there. I'd say, pal. Well, mm -hmm. At the very least, so. I can handle it. All right. We'll think about that later. Anything else you know about this uh, dragon fella? Well, if you can acquire. The silver cloak from his horde, I will be greatly appreciated. Interesting. Interesting. Does yeah. it have any magic properties? Is a sentimental piece, anything like that? Well, to the dragon, it would be. Uh, it belong to the uh, the giant that uh, rose him. Mm. Yeah. Nice. Good to know. Any questions from you, Mr. Tannen? I was just about to say, uh, is, does it happen to be... Uh, I, what's his name? Ben, Thothmir. Ben, how do you pronounce that? Spy? 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 Whatever. Anyway, whatever. Empire dude. Um, on your way back Siren. home... Yeah, him. Siren. Uh, on your way back home, will you happen to be travelling through... Uh, oh god, what's it called now? Dragon's Bridge. 
It's kind of just like squints at you. Dragon's Bridge? Is it Dragon? I don't know. What is it? The called? capital it of the Empire? Yes, that's the one. Yep. Dragon's Bridge, yes. No. Oh. It's our enemy. <laughs> well, I thought you were an Empire person. Are you an ambassador of I'm from Salmor. Or? I was part of the university, but I won't be going back to not to um I almost said null. Uh to <laughs> Neverwinter. <laughs> okay. Okay. To no. Yeah. Well how what if I offered you some money to go that way for me and give a message? He just he just kind of readjusts himself and he just looks you looks you up and down and he goes how much money are we talking? Give me a second, I'll look at my purse. <laughs> because, uh, <laughs> hang on, because he's going to make an, an inside check on this okay. random guy who looks like a homeless man right now. Who's like, I'm going to pay you. <laughs> Why have you changed my breath weapon? I didn't change your breath weapon. Mm, it's open for some reason. I was, I was making a breath weapon for someone else. I was trying to figure out um... how your one was done. No. Yeah, uh, I have. I currently own 157 gold on me at the, t- at the moment. Yeah, I'm not offering all that, but I'm just saying that's how much. Uh, I'll give you mm, 75. You want to pay me 75 gold? Yeah. To travel to Dragon's Bridge. Yeah. The heart of enemy territory. Yeah. And do what? <laughs> Danger money. Uh, supply them with some information. What kind of information? Uh, well, let's just say if they happen to want to invade Spain at any point, that maybe if they came through the Northern Mountain Pass, through uh, House Draconis' territory, they would be gladly welcomed through. So you want me to betray my country? Yeah, basically. For 75 gold. I can give you more if you want more. He just walks away. <laughs> he doesn't say mm-hmm. it. He just shakes his head and walks away. Mm-hmm. Well, I hope you got what you wanted there. Buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I got my information about the dragon. Yeah, well, you got some of your He own. didn't even ask you for payment for the information he gave you. He was just so sick of you, he left. <laughs> Yeah, well, I said Look, buddy, I, honestly, let's 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 take a walk. Right, I I just woke him oh. to a quieter part of town. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Hey, uh, I gotta put him over there. <laughs> All right, oh, then. Yeah, yeah go yeah, on. Right. This is where I get. Shot oh no, 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 you can go with him, Stu, but he he doesn't want to be in real town for the. Minute. <laughs> no, no, I I, I want to walk with. Um, oh, with Altana. Oh, I thought you meant him. He's okay. trying to take no, me to no, a back no. alley to stab me. No, 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 not quite. Not quite. Ooh, ooh. Oh, she can do the opposite. Uh, ooh, ooh. Mm. ooh. The opposite. Dressed. What's the opposite of stabbing? Mm. Ooh. I'm dressed, yeah. Um, <laughs> listen, pal. If you really want to take a message to the uh, I can help you out. But uh, yeah, you realize this is gonna add to your debt to me, yeah? Mm-hmm. Well. We'll talk price later, but I can get some boys that'll deliver your message to the Empire for you. I Let's just can't... call it a fa- favors you'll owe me later on in the long run. Yeah. Let's put it this way: until I have an heir, I have an availability for a, an heir. If you need, if you want to be my heir. Oh my heir. god! Did you just propose I... to him? <laughs> No, well, I first said of I need all, an I, I don't think you can just do that, name me. Uh, this is all based and on the, I'm the head of House Draconis now. <laughs> I can do what I want. I mean, y- you can name me a regent, sure, but I don't think your subjects would accept some rat folk as their lord up in the north. Yeah, that's kind of true. That bones it might be do. a bit more difficult. Yeah. Speaking of which. In the distance, you see a familiar face, I'll tell him. Mm-hmm. That's that bar still. Yeah. <laughs> Wandering through the town is another dragonborn. He's a white dragonborn. Oh, but what the, what's this? El as you've already said that your uncle is dead before I told you. 
in game that your uncle is dead. Yeah. By seeing this person, you can assume that your uncle is dead, as he wouldn't have bothered to con go here all the way to the capital. When did I say my uncle was dead? I said he was still alive. Yeah. Well, you get the impression your uncle's dead if he's here, because he's not <laughs> hunting your uncle down anymore. Oh, uh, okay. Yep, yeah, pressure's on now. You're the last, the last, of the clan. I could take so him. He's on. the lord now of the. Yep, the he is the duke, confronted. the duke or the ducks, which oh, is yeah. Latin for duke. I want to confront Yeah, him. you need to get out of this city, buddy. <laughs> we get back there. Speaking of which, I want to see if he can see El Tannen. Oh shit! Yeah, you make a stealth roll. <laughs> no, fun. I want to take him on. Oh, oh my, oh no, my he's god, he fucking sees you, El Tannen. Yes. Can I roll stealth? Uh, um, yeah, you can. You can, Stu, if you want. Try and hide him. Yeah. Alright. I'd be behind that nice Oh my god, one. he rolled a 20. <laughs> oh god. I nearly I actually did. So, Ribby, you can hide yourself in the crowd. You, Yeah, you know what, I'll do mm. that. I'll just be I think I El Tannen was about to contest it anyway. Yeah, that's fine. I I'll just hide myself. If you want me to hide. Oh, oh wow, that's a good roll. <laughs> he he sees yeah. you for a second, but you duck into an alley really quick. Hmm. All right. Yeah. Let's keep going, buddy. Fuck these. Yeah. That, Him and his boys, his entourage, are looking for you now, but uh, they didn't see where you went. Follow me. Yeah. I. Yeah. I know a place we can go. Um, I'm gonna take him to the brothel that we mentioned last yeah. time. You mean the the Abbey? <laughs> yeah, yeah, the Abbey. Go there. The church. Way back in episode one, we had talked about the Abbey in, in, in Clinton. We're finally going there. <laughs> Lovely. Yep. Yeah. There you go. There's the Abbess. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Uh, She's scary. Do I know her? Um. No, but she. Some she like, knows you. Can I like <laughs> introduce myself in like edgy thieves can? You can, yeah. They like you know. Uh, Sosia told me about you. Pleasure to. Meet and all yeah. That. Oh Very yeah, no, that's all like a thing in thieves can. She'll uh, yeah. also uh, reciprocate and introduce herself as Nikki, yeah. the madam of uh, the brothel. Yeah. AKA I'll the abbess of that... the the convent. <laughs> yeah. I'll just um kind of round off, say to her, you know, we won't be long. I just have some a uh, quick little bit of business to discuss with you, but of a uh, of a different kind, you know, <laughs> like not the usual kind. <laughs> oh, she she figured she get she gets people through here all the time, doing yeah, yeah. other kinds of business. Mm-hmm. I'll just um, say to her that, um, you know, I, I have, you know, associates and connections over on the uh, West Coast. And, like, we may at some point be interested in expanding uh, business to the, the capital. So we'd be more than happy to share in some of this, you know, these opportunities with her and all that stuff. She seems interested. Why, do you yeah. opened up a bathhouse or something? Maybe, possibly, could do a joint venture, or could possibly just deal in uh, trade economy, or uh, you know, just Typical information, trade. just anything. Like if she needs protection, any wet work being done, we could still take that and so forth. Mm -hmm. Get people to do that for. Her. Well, in exchange, she could give me you know intel or just other things, maybe. So. Well, that is something that her girls are good for: is gathering information. Yep. I'll also briefly ask her, I'll try not to make this too long-winded, because we are just kind of sitting here while Will's being searched by the guards and the fucking... <laughs> well, the everyone in the city boy. is looking for him, yeah. Yeah. But I'll suggest that if she, you know, we can talk further business at a later date or whatever, because, mm -hmm. you know, right now I need to get this lad out of here, so... Alright, well, she'll, uh, point you towards a, uh, one of the ramps down to the to a jetty on the docks. If you go down that, there's a tunnel that goes through, like certain parts. Oh, it's of the city. like oblivion. You just yeah. There's like somewhere. a there's like a secret way you can get out of the city without being distract or without being seen as much. Yeah. 
Yeah, just that's go. Awesome. Uh, yeah. you know Don't what? get septimed. For her good uh, will of mm -hmm. being receptive to all the business and giving us that hint. Uh, yeah. mm -hmm. Actually, I'll hold off. Before, I'll thank her for her help and uh, mm -hmm. say, as a, as a gesture of goodwill, do you know and tell about a guy that I'm looking for? Who? Uh, fuck, what's his name? It's on the world and for the Joey. Oh, uh, Joey Cannoli? Joey Cannoli, have you heard of this fellow? And I give her a description all that. Oh, Joey Cannoli. Um, he's upstairs. Is he now? Yeah, he's upstairs. Ah, lovely. He's been, uh, How's he been? He's been putting, uh... He's been pissing everyone off. He's been putting up quite a high bill, uh... At, uh... The expense of the Stratori family. Really? How much does he owe? Uh, about 200 uh, gold. Really? Hmm. But, Is he staying uh, here long term? Yeah, he's been here about, like, two weeks. Alright. I take it, uh... You were looking for him for a particular purpose? I will, um, he's an old buddy of mine, so, but I'll tell you what, I'll, I'm going to do you a big favor since, you know, we're going along so well and, uh, in the interest of future ventures. I'll, uh, I'll front his debt for now, 200 gold. I'll just put down 200 gold for her. She, and, she uh, 100... passes it back. <laughs> it's like, don't worry about it. <laughs> we, we'll, right, well, we'll, uh. We'll discuss it when it becomes when it comes to business ventures. Just get that con out of here. <laughs> of course, of course. Do you want him out today? Preferably. Alright. If but, you're going uh, to uh, put a knife in him, please do it outside. Maybe in the tunnels. Alright. Uh, Alright. Tell you what. Huh. I'll go upstairs and talk to him, but uh, just talking for now. Let's see where this goes. Uh, it's the Tannin. You do me a favor and accompany me. <laughs> sure. Yes. I'm gonna see what this Goomba's up to. Alright. Alright, we, we, we head upstairs. You head upstairs to Joey. <laughs> do we have to pay for the room? Oh no, we're not staying. We're just literally going to see what this is. I apparently don't have Joey's art to hand right now, but uh. It's Joey from can, Friends, right? It's can, literally can, just a picture of Joey from Friends. Can, can yeah. I. Ask her if she has any potions on her at the moment. Yeah. Because I could do a feeling. She feelings. just looks at you and he's like, I run a fucking brothel. What do you I, think? I, I grab your like, <laughs> shoulder a little bit and say, Yeah. And I pass you two potions. Let's mm. go. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Do you got two health potions? No, mm. Will. She only sells the blue potion. <laughs> yeah. She only <laughs> sells the blue potion. A little blue potion. Mm hmm. Our, our healing potion's colored red in this. <laughs> Yes. Sorry, I was showing the uh, Joey Cannoli art on the, uh, the the screen there. Oh yeah. Um. Yeah. So you go upstairs and you find Joey Cannoli sitting on the end of the bed. There's like a woman who's like really pissed off, and she kind of just like pushes past you out of the room. Yeah. yeah. No worries. And I'll just be like, Joey, my pal, how's it going? <laughs> and he's like, Oh yeah. shit. Uh, hey, my, my boy. What what brings you, you all the way here? Ah, well, I was just in town, you know, and went to stop by for a quick uh, drink and a rest, you know. How, how, how have you been, man? I ain't, I ain't seen you for a goddamn year. Oh, all, all, is, all is great. All is amazing. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to make a deception test for Joey. Yeah, he failed completely. Um, <laughs> he clearly I, is not I don't even think I need in. to roll because of the buffs I get for eye for ear for the C and all. Yeah, that shit. no, no, I was I was just trying to see if he if he rolled a twenty or something like that. Yeah, um, but yeah, no, he didn't. He rolled a two. He's blatantly not happy that you're here. All right. Um, do do I know what he's lying about particularly, or um, you you know that he's not happy that. He's been running up a debt in your name here. Oh, he's yeah in the brothel. Yeah, yeah. that makes sense. I'll just kind of go up close to him too and be like, "Joey, why gives? Are you really that short of money? Why are you running up a debt in my name, man? Eh? Thought we were family." 
Yeah, yeah, that that that's that's it. That that's uh yeah, I uh I don't know what to what to do at the, at the moment, Remy. I'm uh I'm feeling a bit nervous. Yeah? What yeah. makes you so nervous, pal? Come on, we can work this out. I forget uh, what your rival family's name was. Um call them the Let me type in the Godfather video game as a family. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> But the Godfather the video game is actually fun. Um, let me see. I was an accident. I didn't mean to press up. <laughs> Dale uh, Tannen is just singing a song in the background. The it's a pretty families. catchy one too. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm just imagining he's like in the in, in the fucking background, just juggling. <laughs> yeah, well, there's a reason I brought Will up here, which he might, might come into play. I, I am promoting morale for him. Yeah, balancing on the unicycle. Yeah. Juggling. Are you feeling uneasy now? How about <laughs> now? God, okay. He's moving around oh. in the bush as they're having a serious conversation. I'll just hey, like. Hey, Joey! Get... Hey, Joey! Check this out! <laughs> <laughs> I'll just do like the the swallowing the sword trick and everything. Oh my god! The Gambinos. There you go. Gambino, yeah. Yeah, the Gambinos. Oh, the Gambino rivals. family. Yeah, Joey's afraid that the Gambino family might find him, which is why you and him came here. All right. Was to hide from the Gambinos. Listen, listen, yeah. Joey. I need to leave town soon. Why don't you come with me and my friend here, and we'll. Uh... Go find you, uh, have some Satori help. Yeah, so you sure. Can stay safe, figure out what you need to do. Yeah. I need to escape anyway, so, uh. Where are we going? Right. Sure. Let's go, pal. Yep. Yeah. He, like, gets his, like, pants on and follows behind you. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. He was just weaning out this whole conversation. <laughs> <laughs> I like how he's just been sitting there. <laughs> Well, Will's well, just in the doorway, crossed on by the <laughs> deep throwing a sword. <laughs> yeah. Oh, can I do a perception or insight? See if he's carrying any weapons. Only in D and D. Yeah, sure. Yeah. I've got a passive perception of nineteen. So I, see it. <laughs> I have a one of eighteen as well. <laughs> that has been staring like at his dick the whole time. <laughs> I, oh I my see god! His, I see everything, including his balls. Like, just... <laughs> Lovely. What? While you're looking at his, what? While you're looking at his dick, he has a knife. Uh, he's a dagger. It, where is it? Yeah, it's he, has a, he has a dick knife. <laughs> <laughs> well, god. he's he put his pants on, sword. so it's not, it's at his waist now. All right. Cool. I, yeah. Nothing I special. Be... Just the nah, he just has a dagger. Vampire slaying cocksaws. Actually, no, it's not I... even a dagger. It's just a knife. It's just a regular knife. Can I knife. sleight of hand the knife out when he's getting dressed? Yeah, you can. I do yeah. believe it's this kind of technology they call a frontal stinger. <laughs> oh, <that>? wow. <laughs> yeah. Well, his passive perception is like 10, so that he, you managed to do that easily. <laughs> so he's got no other weapons. <laughs> Alright. Does it hop out? Hey, no, come on. Uh, let's we'll walk out of the brothel and mm -hmm. go down the secret passage. Yep. He's put uh, his knife. He's like knife on, but it's just the sheet. You've taken the blade out of the, the sheet. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Um. Uh, yep. Nikki will give you a wave goodbye as you go out and give you a wink. Yeah, I'll give her the thumbs up. Yeah. Wink, so leave, yeah. But basically, a thank you for taking him out of here. <laughs> yep. I will chuck her a gold coin for saying thanks for letting She you looks very insulted. <laughs> oh well. She can get fucked then. I'll, I'll just give her coin. an extra wink, like, I'll yeah. in Thieves sign, like, I'll pay you more later. Don't yeah. Worry, <laughs> yeah, my people will come back. Uh, yeah. right. You get the impression she wanted to discuss things with you later anyway, so. Alright, that's, yeah. that's cool. Alright. So you go out the sewers. Yep, you go down into the sewers with Joey. And can you make another okay. stealth test to see if you can get out of the city without being spotted? Sure. Yeah. Will, you can, I guess, assist me there. Yeah, wow. You know. We actually yeah. need to the Yep, city. the sewers are a good way out, apparently. A diver has a lot of weapons. I'm very good at stealth. So the three of you are down in the sewers in a nice isolated area. Yep. Yep. Uh, <sighs> to be sure fair, it probably does help, but I do have like five on my stealth. So, 
What do I know about Joey, like, before all you, this? You know that Joey this? betrayed you. For certain, like... Oh, he... He's kill him. He has been informing on you. Uh, on the Stratori family, goes. to the... Um, well, to the government. Oh, to the government? Oh, yeah. he's, a, he's a fucking narc. He was oh. a rat the whole time. Oh, that's even mm. worse. Oh. <laughs> yeah, he's an actual rat. <laughs> Well, we're in the best place for it, I think. Yep. <laughs> All right. Just I like just, El Tannen, rather than you. He was ready to do this all the time. Not at all. Hey, hey Tannen. Uh, what? Show us your muscle, eh? I'm just uh, like okay. you. Okay. <laughs> Grab the fucker. I'll donate to the strength. Okay. He's about to say, hey, Remy, remember the time? And then he grabs him. Yeah. Yeah. I will cut that nest full of gun dots. I'll like grab his legs and shit so he can actually. Oh no. Yeah. Be, like, we'll um Get force it. him down. <laughs> oh my god. He's gonna Let's force him down underwater actually. Oh, we'll <laughs> He's oh, gonna okay. try we'll and defend himself. Him uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Water. That, uh, would you like to make a strength like, test too? I may be a rat, but you're an even worse. <laughs> <laughs> can can you make a strength test too to see if you can right. hold him down because he broke out of El Tan? Well, there you go. An athletics test. <laughs> athletics. Yeah. Well, that's just strength test is what you've done there. No, it's fine. My athletics is pretty. It's good fine. Enough. I was going to ask for strength anyway. <clears throat> he was about yeah, to break out from El Tan, but uh, Rimmy has him by the legs, so he can't get up. Mm -hmm. No, please. Can't push him down. Uh, Remember the good old days, him. Remy. No. What if I just use yeah. my, my breath on him? <laughs> um. Nah, nah, it's all good. Let's do it this way. <laughs> you, know, you know when you like murder down. someone and you're trying to make it look like it was an accident? <laughs> yeah. Burning him alive is probably going to be obvious at once in an accident. <laughs> oh no, right, another how, sewer how gas explosion. Like, oh, tragic. Roll. Do we have to roll damage or something? Oh, to kill him? I'll bite him and make yeah. it look like it was a vampire oh attack. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> if it was a vampire attack, it's fine. <laughs> I, I guess roll your damage. He only has four hit points. <laughs> Holy cow. Oh god, he's poisoned? He's dead, yeah. Alright. Why do you do poison damage? I would've liked, but they'll do. Know. Thanks, man. Why have I got poison on a bite? There's probably a reason. All you right. probably took a feat that gives it to you. Well, just this, yeah, his, his the, like, yeah, the the damage on that wasn't even a roll; it's set number of ten plus two, so it always does twelve for some reason. I think the macro is screwed up. I can fix that if you need to. Yeah. It's I, fine. He's dead. Now, now he really is sleeping with the fish. Yeah, that, yeah. I don't think there's fish in there, Stu. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sleeping no. with the rat. There's a lot of gold. There's probably fish other. There's little rats, maybe. Here yeah. <laughs> he. Uh, <laughs> He slept in my uh, you've got a mouth full of sore water now as well. Probably. Yeah. Crunchy. Add it to my list of inconveniences. <laughs> the exact Thanks, man. Let's, let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> here we go. Yeah. I can Count add something to your list of inconveniences. <laughs> Ebola. <laughs> Counter mouthwash. He's got Ebola now. Mouth the dewash. Yeah. So I'll just get some lem sip it with him. <laughs> God. What was the proof that he was a government rat? Um, the spy told you. No, not oh, the spy. Yeah, the yeah. um, the vampire told you. Turns out he's innocent to along. <laughs> and and my um, eye for I'm guessing my ear for deceit knew something was sus anyway. So yeah, the vampire had told you because he was trying to indict you to him. Yeah. But like, yeah. and what I'm saying is, is that does it collaborate with what um, he was saying? So he was lying and stuff. Oh yeah, no, he was obviously lying. You figured yeah, out that he'd been lying to you the whole time. Yeah. Because yeah. I did kind of want to drag him off to ascertain with the, my own people to see if he was actually really a rat or not. But yeah. It, I'm guessing it's really obvious that he was. So you ca you literally caught him with his pants down. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. That may have been done on purpose. <laughs> oh, uh, by the way, here, this is a gift for you to attend. And 
I'll give him the dagger. Mm. <laughs> oh, okay. oh, it's just a regular knife. That was his one d three damage. Yeah, uh, yeah slashing damage. Useful, yeah. So. I'll just put it back in the guy's sheath. Oh, I thought we were gonna chuck <laughs> it in the river. Okay. <laughs> Actually, that's funny because it's like yeah. he didn't even get to defend himself. So. No, you, you you caught him off guard. You didn't. Know. I will neatly place it back into the sheath. Uh, right. Are you gonna leave it on him? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's kind of funnier that way, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He, it just gets the impression he didn't even get the time to draw his weapon. So yeah. It's on fire. <laughs> oh my god! There's a crocodile in the sewers. <laughs> yeah. Snap! Snap! Right. Let's go. All right. Are we outside the city? Yeah. No, you can easily get get outside the city. You make your way into the Nevor Forest. Nice. Yeah. We like. Hi, pal. Uh, so I, I've got two ideas for you. Either you oh. uh, start walking all the way back home. <laughs> Oh, uh, maybe you uh, come with That's me, and we'll go find your men first, and then you get the fuck out of here once you got your men. Because I, I don't think Mister Hector would be pleased to see you right now. I can't imagine he will be now. No, and collect those Wing Lazar boys. He is because, well, if that other dragon fuck is after you in the city, well, you should probably have some troops with you as well. Mm hmm. You know. Get, get your boys together. Mm. Alright, we should probably get star started as well now. Ready for a long walk? Yeah. Alright. I'll get on my pony and just kind of trot along and you'll have to follow. I think, nah, it's, I think I it's gonna take you two days to get there. I'll tell you what, let's start by a yeah. fucking ranch or something. Why, do, why don't you just go and ride off and do your thing and I'll just walk and Oh, adventure! Think about my, well, my actions on the way. I mean, do you really want to go through the forest all by your lonesome until you get to your men? No, sure. gives me time. You to hear think. howling in the distance of wolves. Ah, I can take wolves. In. Oh my god! Okay, you kind of hurt there, buddy. I mean, hey, I know you're a badass dude and all that with all your armor and swords, but wolves are vicious. Cunt. It was like they attack with uh, ten boys at once. It's this tough fight. I'll be okay. You go and return to your master. Uh, well, more like his dad's my boss, but yeah, oh. I get you what you mean. Uh, Somewhat master. Look, let's stop at a ranch at least, get your fucking pony or something. Mm. Oh, wait, you've got one, haven't you? I've got a lizard, <laughs> yeah. Is, is it a good mount, the lizard? I don't know. It's in the city still. You've got a strider and you left it behind. Yeah. All right, we'll get you a new mount. Mm. <laughs> you see a guy like riding past on a on a horse by himself. I own a saddle, and, and he just like <laughs> he just like tips his hat at you, Remy, and he goes, "Howdy, howdy there, friend!" And he just keeps riding. Howdy, pal! You know, like a red, red dead. dead thing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's find a fucking rat. A yeah. Fucking horse no, he's by himself, and he's not armed. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa what's going on? Shooting him, hold my horse. Oh, he oh okay. Shoots him, steals him. Did, did Very... you kill him? I Before guess. Before you, be, you just tip your your like hood at him, and you're like, "Howdy there, friend!" And he's <laughs> shot in the neck, and just starts bleeding out. The okay, ground. I I stop the horse and run over to this guy and uh, drag him off the road, and I'm like, "Grab his horse, ten, and then yeah, okay." <laughs> This is one of the most red dead moments ever. <laughs> Didn't think you were gonna ask oh the things that much. <laughs> oh Damn my it. God. I stop and start to run after the horse too. I'm like, hey, give me a bye. Yeah, man. Oh my it's god. I'll tell him the horse runs away, but then, then Stu it. catches it for you. I just love this. Howdy, partners. <laughs> 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 I'm fucking dying. Jesus. Fucking hell. What kind of horse does this guy have? I don't know. Uh, let, me, let me see. Oh my He's God. an actual horse, not a pony as well. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a riding horse as well. Same it's as your a one. Hold on, Palomino, man. 
Yeah. Is that our chance to do heavy for Voldemort? Uh, I'm trying to find the thing I have a No, it's, it's better that you have a horse, not a pony, honestly, when, when I come to think of it. Oh, well, what is it called? It was just a light boy. Yeah. yeah. I'm a heavy boy. Yeah. The farm animals, there it is. Alright, I'll, I'll check what this guy had in his pockets for them and stuff. Oh, shit. You find, like, uh, like 12 gold pieces. And a, there you uh, go, Mr. Tannen. A letter. You'll kill your money. <laughs> what? How much? 12 gold. There you go, I'll pass it over to you. There you go, he's got a... And I'll be like, you may as well take his clothes and all the other bullshit on him. Right. You've got a paint. A spare. What colour yeah, is what... your horse, Stu? Uh, probably just a brown, I'm guessing. It's pretty common. Just like a chestnut brown? Ew. There you go. What, what is this weird oh, we are man carrying? Yeah. <laughs> We've got fucking mounts. Oh. I've already got a saddle too. Yeah. Yep. What's he yeah, carrying? I like the idea lost? that not only is Kenan walking around with like 20 weapons, but he's also got a saddle over his shoulder this whole time. <laughs> Apparently so. I know, they were saddled already and he stole some guy's horse. No, but he's had one, apparently. Yeah, I've had a saddle on my infantry since before. Oh, he was oh, talking to the, the queen with a saddle on his yeah. shoulder, like, oh yeah, hey. Yeah. <laughs> oh my uh, god. Did this guy have anything else on him? Also carrying his shield. He had, a, he, had a, he had a letter. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'll read the letter. <laughs> Inventory <laughs> management. Yeah. The letter is like, Obviously. sorry for the tragic news of the loss of your uh, your brother. You know, come to collect his uh, uh, possessions. At the uh, church of the emperor yeah. in Clinton. That man was already in a bad spot. It seems. <laughs> <laughs> he, had a, he had a fall. He's, he's fine. Uh, yeah, his his son clothes, will be though. waiting here for you as well. <laughs> oh, his son? Oh, fuck. He fell and snapped. His I'll, I'll hold fine. on to the ladder, actually. Fuck it. Just be like. <laughs> you just got to steal might, a child. I might, I might look into that at some point. Actually, yeah. I, can will, I wonder how old the boy is. <laughs> You're going to kill the boy it as well. Say. No, no, no. We can do this as a mafioso. For extra extra. I don't kill children, stupid. Oh and then my God. he finds out where I have limits. Hey, I know what happened to your dad. <laughs> <laughs> Who's your daddy? Or your, your uncle around the fuck, please. Yeah. I mean, unless you do something, he's probably going to come after you like, I'm looking for the man who killed my father. I mean, I've yeah, exactly. That's what I'm waiting for. <laughs> Fucking yeah. 20 years down the line, he just comes out to just see you. <laughs> just how Tannen's an old man in an open It is a very... It is a very oh, specific you. thing that would happen in one of my campaigns, actually. Right. <laughs> I mean, that's what happens when you kill a kid's dad, usually. I'll drag the body off to the river or wherever the fuck and just... Just hide it in a bush. Up <laughs> You'll just throw this guy with a fucking bolt in his neck into the river. I'll take the bolt out and clean it and be like, here you go. <laughs> you know, you might need ammo. <laughs> what would I need to roll to, like, sort of... Uh, surround him in sort of foliage. <laughs> He's in the river. <laughs> oh, is he? Oh, you've chucked him in the river. I'll just drown to the side of the river. Who gets oh, okay. okay. There's no just forensics in fucking. Deep. Well, there is. Yeah, make sure you get rid of. Well, I can set him on fire if you want. Cause... He's got a pollute. That's the actually river. not a bad idea. There'll be no <laughs> DNA. There'll be no DNA. Yeah. If anything, it, the, the kid might actually start believing his dad just went out for milk and never came back. <laughs> <laughs> just like his uncle is always ready to collect him. <laughs> <laughs> it's never okay, showed so up. Chris, the body. Gonna go get okay, milk and yeah. pipe weed. I'll be back tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, a bit of old Toby. <laughs> oh shit! Because you're riding now. Yeah, because so the guy is in the river. Will he, he? He doesn't really catch fire that much. No. Oh, okay. Never mind. Yeah. All right. We'll so we'll, we'll ride off into the sunset. Oh my god! Up north. You begin your three day. Your three day oh. travel to the, to the siege. Two, it's three days now, jeez. No, it's been three days the whole time, but I was going to count it as two because they were ahead of you by like oh, yeah. a day. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. All right. So, meanwhile, back at the siege. <laughs> I see. Mm -hmm. Yep. I see the Spanish guys getting uncomfortable that the lizard, the. The winged lizards the are en engaging the guys. <laughs> They're kind of uh, looking to see what you want to do over there. 
Feel free to go on ahead. Uh, they're not with us. All right. Well, I'll have to. Uh... Is there a um... is there a tent free, gentlemen? Well, you're the boss. You can just take any tent. Excellent. I'll yeah. take this tent for the moment. Mm -hmm. That's my tent. Um. Yes. Let's. Um... We need some uh, people to uh, keep guard of the camp, just in case. Considering they're sending out scouts. So, just guard the camp and uh, we'll wait until uh, the crusade goes on ahead. We'll uh, cover the back troops. Okay, I'll be back in five. Or ten. A little rabbit by your tent there. Uh, hello. It's like hop Yeah, little rabbit. Here we go. Um, There's your wife's horse. <laughs> She's got a white, a white stallion. Ho oh, ho! Oh. Damn. Hex is just gonna scratch the top of the rabbit's head, I guess. Yep, and the rabbit just like hops off. There you go. Bye bye, little fella. Well, I'm glad Beats isn't alive anymore. You feel a cold chill down the back of your neck as you say that. Oh god. Hmm. He's watching you. Wait a minute. Fucking rabbit. If anybody sees the rabbit here, I want it grilled and served. This is suddenly a bunch of goblins run off and are killing a bunch of rap. You just hear it. Eh, eh. Every now and again, it just as the rabbits are just like murdered. And that's when rabbits went extinct in Spain. <laughs> okay. Anyways, back to business. <laughs> They're just going around catching rabbits. All right, what are you doing in your tent? Okay. How do we want Rosa. to know what you're doing in your tent? Rosa, I need business. Hello. Hola. Hola. How can I help you? So, um, would it count as killing in my name if they're um, killing in the name of a crusade? Yeah. While it's related with the siege. I see no reason why not. She like steps outside your tent, kind of looks at the big pile of dead bodies over there. It's like, what are you doing? The guys have been doing pretty good so far. We've never, Wait, you're cut, we've cut never had the, the uh... oh yeah, and those rabbits too. Oh, okay. Yeah, we've never had a, uh... we had to open up a new uh, re reception as uh, there's been so many souls appearing. Yeah, well, fair enough. Not bad. Hmm. Quick question. Uh, now that I have that clarified, uh, as long as we'll be gaining from the crusade being declared, um, do you perchance maybe have a soul down there named Beats? He uh, yeah. looks we like these... Let me check the furry roster. Master. Like the furry boys? Well, let me check the roster. She like pulls out a big book and just plunks it down on, the on like a little table. <laughs> the table starts to almost give way. It's so heavy. Mm. She like scrolls through it. Beats, 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 beats. Hmm. You don't appear to, no. Would you be able to confirm for me whether somebody is dead in general, or just if they're in your possession? I'm a lawyer. Sorry, if they are in your inventory. Hmm. Well, they don't appear to be in the inventory. However, uh... I could summon the boss. You don't have to. Um, I just need to... If possible, confirm 
that he's somewhere in the earth, like among the dead, if possible. <laughs> Hello there! It's like a giant man appears yeah. in your tent. He <laughs> like pulls out some of the pegs. Well, well, hello uh, there. Hola. Uh, somewhat unexpected. Uh, so, um, quick question. Um, oh, yeah, and I can uh, scoot over a bit. He, like, shrinks himself down. <laughs> uh, thank you. He has um, polymorph. He could do that. <laughs> would you be able to clarify for me if somebody is counted among the... Uh, the dead in general. Oh. What an odd request. Okay. Just a particular uh, person or bastardo, rather. Oh, what's his name? Uh, Beats. You have to be a bit more specific. Pardon. Uh, There's quite, quite a lot of people in hell, you know. Let's see. Mm, I love to think. Okay, I I'll need to find the name. If somebody else wants to do something meanwhile, feel free to. Would I actually know his full name? You do. Okay. Is it? <laughs> I, I can Is tell it? you, but I'm not. <laughs> yeah, because I got the page, but I'm unsure if part of it is his title or his, his name. name. Is Beat Seguidor? Oh, no, that's his. Class. That's his rank. Um, okay, that is his title. Oh, okay. hang on. Yeah, it's not. Is uh, Calico was his name. Ah, Calico. It's not on the. It's, you're right. It's not on the on the page there. Yeah, because it's uh, his father's name. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Yes, it uh, beats Calico. Oh. Never heard that name before. Sounds familiar. familiar. All right, we don't have that anyone of that name, but it sounds familiar. Okay, you you don't have him, but does somebody have him? I think, he, I think he was sent back. What do you mean sent back? Yeah, he had a he had a friend who. Uh, what was his name? Deforir. Oh, he was summoned back by one of those demons, bastards. Damn. Oh. Baka, that's it, Baka. What is this? Yeah, one of those demons, Baka, or some bullshit. I see. Baka, you called him. Yeah, he's a demon. He, uh. He, uh -huh. he deals in necromancy and shit. We hadn't seen him in quite, quite a while. Maybe about 10,000 years. I see. So he was returned. Yep. Come to think of well, it, he's, he's, he took away Henry Every as well. A couple of years ago. About well, 10, 15 years. Be? Yeah. I, I am unfamiliar with his name. Uh, who, who is this person? Ah, uh, some pirate cunt. Doesn't matter. Anyway, nice. um, yeah. Well, it seems I have some unfinished business. Would you like some tequila? Before sure. you go back. Okay. Gentlemen, do we have some tequila with us? Oh, I have my own. He like pulls out like Kipling's bird tequila. Have you tried this? It's new. It's pretty good. <laughs> what in... What is that? It looks <laughs> off-brand. Yeah, it he, like, he, he like starts wiggling the little snake inside. <laughs> who, who puts those things in a tequila? I have no idea, but it's a novel idea. Quite absurd. Can't can't believe somebody thought of it. Here, and he just like summons a wine glass and hands it to you. I take it I that pass. you uh you prefer yours in a wine glass. <laughs> See, but uh, I don't think I can drink foreign tequila. All right, especially not one that uh, bastardizes it. Like he this. like tosses it out to one of the guys. They just like start fighting over it. 
Did you make this? No, some uh, some new distillery. Well, I see. Must be. Anyway, terrible. if you find this Parker, um, let me know. Uh, you might need some help. Is he uh, an enemy or an associate? An enemy. I see. So be it. He a, will. Um... A great enemy. <laughs> Hector will extend his hand. It would be um, a gentleman's agreement. If I find mm -hmm. any clues of him, you will know. Yeah. Excellent. He may be trapped inside a doll. Last time I uh, seen him, he was uh, a, doll. In a doll. Yeah, we laughed at him. It was pretty funny. The Christmas party, you know. Um, but yeah, um, we may have had a hand in uh, assisting the binding of the... Uh, Demons. I see. Wait. You mean uh, would he be? Uh, would Hector, technically speaking, be familiar with the buying of the demons, like event? Nope. You have speaking? no idea what okay. he's talking about. Buying of the demons. Okay. Yes. Uh, of course. Yes. Uh, what is that? You hear a voice in your head. <laughs> Careful about lying to me. <laughs> and then he just says, Oh, yeah, so there was these demons. They caused a lot of trouble. And, uh, you know, us devils, we hate demons. We uh, came and assisted with binding up the uh, minor demon princes. I see. All six of them. They say there's five. There's six. Those people don't know how to count. Six demons. Would you also be interested in anything regarding the others? Yeah. I see. Wouldn't mind destroying them completely. You know, it's I funny to laugh at them while they're trapped in dolls and can't do anything. However, you know, the humans are not great at uh, resisting them. I shall keep it in mind then. It's a bit dangerous, as it turned out. How powerful are these demons? pretty. However, I'm afraid any further information will require more souls. Understandable. Well, I shall uh, try to maintain our agreement as, well, I shall maintain our agreement, I mean. Mm -hmm. Until then, I wish you a good day. Yeah. I must get day. back to a uh, business of collecting your he, souls. He like snaps his red cane on the uh, on the floor. So he just gives you a nod and then just Poof, he's gone. Well, thank you, Rosa. I suppose that was quite enlightening and quite confusing. Mm -hmm. I still don't know what he meant by the binding of the demons, but uh, anyways, have a good day. Um, you're dismissed, unless you have any business you want to talk about. I wouldn't mind watching the battle, but okay. Oh, you... You can, of course. Mm -hmm. Certainly. Uh, beware, however, there, uh, considering there is a crusade involved, uh, well, I doubt anyone's really going to give you too much attention, but uh, you never know. Even Some if they of did. these fanatics are unpredictable. Even if they did, they wouldn't stand a chance. Good to hear. She, like, climbs up to the top of the tower to watch from there. <laughs> She doesn't even climb, she just flies up. <laughs> well, hope you like the company of archers. Alright. So, okay. does anyone else want to do anything before we begin? Uh, Spacho, uh, if we're gonna wait till morning to attack, Spacho's gonna go that night to do his Spacho things. Mm hmm. Or you wanna wait another I day? Can... Cool. Um, uh, all right, I I lost internet earlier, and uh, okay. then I just got back from helping my dad with something, so yep. I kind of missed a little bit. But the uh, time frame wise, uh, show the night before. So, yep. Dispatcho. Boss, what is Erica up to? Erica is, um, <laughs> she 
she's gonna go find the darkest place she can find so she can just sit and brood for a bit. Cause she's she has... gonna sit down next to all the dead bodies and just sit there looking at them and brooding. Exactly, yeah. Cause she knows, yeah. you know, we're about to go into a battle. Might be some time before she gets to brood again, so you yeah. know, gotta get it in now. It's gonna be busy, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh, Skog. What is Freena up to? Well, I suppose I'm going to be keeping Mr. Hector company and making sure that none of those scouts get to him. Otherwise, I suppose I'll be trying to, you know, make sure all my equipment is ready for tomorrow or mm -hmm. whenever the things happen. Just oh, empty yeah. things. I appreciate the dedication, Freena. Yeah. So, the night falls. All the campfires start being lit. You notice that coal goes around and lights a bunch of extra campfires around your camp to make it look like you have more men than you actually do. A very smart coal. Yeah, he gives you a high five. <laughs> it's not my <laughs> first rodeo. Indeed, you're quite experienced. I know, I, I knew I'd like to. And you show really not what it takes to do it, this sort of thing. Mm -hmm. Frankie drunkenly walks past. You tried this new tequila, boss? It's pretty good. Frankie, we're besieging <laughs> tomorrow. Even more reason Please. to get into it. Just make sure you drink a lot of water. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you turn yourself invisible while you're brooding. <laughs> it's an accident. I was trying to make sure it was prepared and I clicked the wrong button. <laughs> I'm just going to sit by all the dead bodies and make myself invisible so no one bothers me. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? <laughs> oh god, it doesn't count as one of your spells for the battle day either. Oh, so, good. <laughs> as night falls and slowly becomes dusk. You all awake to like Spacho. do breakfast things. You like make some bacon on a little grill. One of the goblins is making some bacon over here on a on the is, little grill. Is it rabbit bacon? Uh, it, it is now. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> you have a lot of rabbit meat, so you might as well be. Mm. And as uh, you hear like the sizzling of the bacon, you're just all like waiting your turn to be fed. You start to hear like some uh, battle noises in the behind the distance. Mm. As, Somebody uh, um, the battle has begun uh, and they forgot to tell you. <laughs> what about his pacho? Uh, uh, you, you, you can see it. You're watching the battle from the trees. Oh, like what? Have, I was going to go out that night. Oh, are stuff. you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, do you wanna, yeah. Do you wanna sneak out? Whole, what are you doing? Uh, his pacho is going to try to sneak into the enemy camp and sow chaos. Oh, hang on. Let me swap you to the. To the... To this map a minute. In the middle of the night, he's gonna wait till like one or two a.m. Maybe. maybe yeah. Two a.m. sounds yep, good. Yep. In the middle of the night, the guys are kind of. There's always someone at their at their post, but they're not really paying attention as much attention at night. Yeah, Would you like I'll to uh, try and sneak in? Make a stealth test, yes. please. Yes. Give, give me a second to get his watch even on the map. I dragged him over, but he's not NFS. I see him. I see him. Okay. Yeah, can you make sure he has uh, 32 HP? Every time I drag it over, it seems he to does. not auto-correct that. He does. That. Okay, good. Uh, where are we on the map, actually? He's at the very bottom the there. bottom left. Yeah. Yeah. He's not... I'm going to reload quick. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. Alright, so in the current situation, uh, my passive, I believe, is 18. Passive perception. Yeah. Can I see who's who's like standing on guard and who's not actually there? Because the map is not like uh, it's the daytime map still. Yeah. A lot of when someone out. is not on duty, another guy comes and takes his place. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I'll uh, I'll ask you where the the actual people who are awake and guarding. Yep. Yeah. As you're like flying over the building, there you see some other guys over here. Yeah, give me a moment. They're just on patrol. Black. 
black it's... graph on my end. Still trying to reload it. Oh, you don't see down here? I, I, I can't see anything you're pinging at because my map is black right now. It's really... Oh, okay. Ah, okay. Yeah. It's probably still loading. Remember, I have trash internet. My internet is made out of rocks and sticks. Oh, God. <clears throat> And his cutter sent him. Uh, okay, come on, game. I believe in you. I believe in you. You can do it, all right. If you wanna load the screen, I'm dying inside. <laughs> How could this happen me? to me? The really get the refresh. <laughs> <laughs> it is loading. <clears throat> I am still waiting. No, no, All right, no, so no, I, saw no. that I saw that thing down there. So there's guys over there. Can, can you see the guys? Yep. Uh, yep. I can see these guys. I've yep. got um, which, hidden map which, all which, around this area. That's good. Which way are you flying? Uh, his pacho is not going to fly so much once he gets to town because he's not sure. I've perched you on top of the him. building so you can see from there. Yeah. Where's disguise yeah. as a pacho in today? Uh, his pacho is going to put on his cat outfit. <laughs> and he's going to prowl along the rooftops like a cat. Can you make a stealth test? <clears throat> yes, I can. Yeah, he's a meow. <laughs> <laughs> Really aggressive. It's the most top. grotesque. Like this, this cat does not look right because it's a it's a hollowed out animal that does not fit inside the other animals. So. Yeah. So, Still. Yep. They don't notice the. Well, they just see a cat. It's fine. Yep. So the cat is going to prance along the rooftops and. Yep. Kind of work its way north. Gotta peek over the edge here and see what it can see. Okay. Yeah, there's some boys down there. Yes, Pasta, that's pretty close. <laughs> yep. So with, uh, using his wings to make his landing quiet, he's gonna hop down off the roof. Yep. And pitter patter along the ground mm -hmm. as a cat and duck into the bushes. Start working his way up to where the ward camp was. Yep. These guys the, you uh, saw like patrolling around and whatnot, they don't notice you. Yeah, he, yeah. Is the uh, big old big guy still there? Yeah, he's still peeing. Still peeing? Yeah. Okay. Well, he's just gonna be like, hey, he's still peeing. <laughs> he's gonna keep going. Would you drink too much water? <laughs> yeah. He'll uh, work his way back up to a rooftop yeah. over here and come up to the edge. Yeah, more, the more patrols go past you. Yeah. And when their backs are to him, we'll just flap across and mm -hmm. get to the next side and keep yeah. up. But uh, when we get to where the ward camp is, can Hispacho kind of identify who, like, the the, the, the wolf pack leader slash, like, the, the ward rider leader? Yeah, this guy over them? here appears to be the leader. I recognize the alpha. Yeah. All right. Uh, Hispacho's going to try to work his way across the rooftop as quietly as possible. And he will get out one of those grung venoms. Yeah. Nice. And he's going to try to splash it on this guy and potentially on the uh, warg as well if he has to like fly up and like literally drop the drip the goop on them. Yeah. Make a dex, dribble. dex check. All right. Just dex check. Yeah. See if you can All right. drop it in the right place. Oh, shit. And you know what, Ben? There's conveniently a chimney right here so you can like duck into the chimney so you don't get yeah, shot. Yeah, yeah. He, he... Yeah, he disappears after he yep. splashes them with with grung contact points. Did I give you a thing to use to show me what the listing is on that? Uh, the grung venom. It's yeah. uh, the I don't know what the DC is. I don't think I have the DC, but the uh, affected uh, creature becomes afraid of its ally. Yeah, I'm yes, trying to find the orange. Trying to find it here. Venom. Oh, yeah, it's DC just straight con. up afraid of allies. Okay, there is no DC save. Okay, yeah, so the the warg the warg leader and the warg oh my god animal freak out. Oh my god! <laughs> there you start doing some rolls. 
I imagine the wargs can smell the fear and immediately want to destroy it. I'm just going to do three for each. So there's three from him. And then let me go over here and go... Uh, da, da, da. It's down here somewhere. Everything is buried in walls of text. Uh, I should probably use the scimitar. Never mind. Yep. <laughs> they just start fucking killing each other. A big fight breaks out. Let's hope it spreads. Only as two. long as the words smell weakness amongst them, there will be blood. <laughs> Only two of them survived on uh, half health. Bacho oh, is content oh. with that and keeps moving on. <laughs> uh, he's going to start working his way towards the uh, primary citadel area. Uh, we'll keep an eye on this patrol until it's got its back to him and is preferably moving away. Mm -hmm. If his spots you can do it. You know, it'd gonna... be a really good target for that Grung Venom. Oh, that patrol is <laughs> running over here really quick to figure out what's going on. Yeah, his gotcha's gonna hook around and yeah. just come straight over this way. That cliff is about 15 foot high, you can easily get up it. Yeah, he'll probably hop from, like, crag to crag. Not yeah. at the top, because he's not gonna show in his horizon himself. But yeah, let me just it. hide all these areas. I'm right blind! No! Let me just hide all the areas you've passed through. <laughs> Am I dead? Am I dead? The whole world went black, man. That's crazy. <laughs> Am I blind? And so his spot was consumed by the darkness. No, my fate uh... caught up with me. No. There you go. All right. So his is gonna come over here and peek around the area. Let me just reveal this. Yep. When we were here before, did it seem like this was one of the primary wells, water sources? Yeah, that, that was, used? yeah. Mm -hmm. he's, gonna, he's gonna pour two hemlock poisons in there. <laughs> throw up two down there. Yeah. And then All he's right, gonna work his way. Are you on the way. outside of the walls, or are you gonna climb on, up on top? Uh, his bacho is going to kind of like hop on this rooftop and scan the walls to see mm -hmm. who's up on them. That guy walks around and then goes down the ladder. Where we're at? There's mm -hmm. a, like a... You get the impression there's like a trap door like over here somewhere. Okay. Are there he, he like peeks over but he doesn't see you and then he just goes down the ladder. Yeah. Are there open windows or anything like that? There is an open window. Ping it for me. Yeah. Please. It's actually right where the la just right below the ladder. Right about there. Yeah. Yeah. Spacha is going to crawl over to the window. Oh, shit. But he's not going to peek at it yet. He's going to, uh... He's going to cast Minor Illusion with the little rhino thing. Yeah. To make the, like, the area of the window look like a plain vista of the ocean from the window. <laughs> So no matter what's in the window, the window looks like it's normal. Oh, it's, it's a like lake. Oh, yeah. Nice. Yeah, like, he's just gonna make the window look like, when he comes in the window, like, sitting on the windowsill, it still looks like normal window without anything sitting on the windowsill, mm -hmm. basically. But I'll count that off as the casting that's up for the day. And he'll hop up onto the windowsill. Yeah. And peek around into the room. You may drop yourself down here on the window. Is that not... Why is nothing working? There we go. Uh, hold on, it's reloading for me. Yeah. Alright, let me uh, pull the spot show down there. Yep. So he's right here on the window. Yep, there's a whammon. A hobgoblin whammon sitting on the bed. Alright. Is there anyone else in the room? Nope. Gonna very carefully peek around. The guy who went down the stairs. Okay. He's gonna kind of stand at the edge of the stairs and like look, like, you know, dip his head upside down mm -hmm. under down. the uh, staircase and look at the room below. 
from the stairs. Yeah, you can you see can the top, the, the bottom floor there. There's there's a lot of people. All right. Yeah. The spacho is going to. The woman is sobbing quietly. Okay, Spacho is going to pitter patter over, and like hop up on the chest there. It's like really betraggled, gnarly looking cat. He's just gonna go, meow. There you go. That's the best I can do with short notice. <laughs> the yeah, beautiful that's lady. Fine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Who are you? Oh no. Who are you? Yeah. Meow. Hey, hey, so, um. <laughs> like he's oh gonna like pry the, the, he's gonna pry the cat's mouth open and stick his head out. <laughs> <laughs> like, hey, don't don't be quiet. I'm here to help. Don't drink the water, okay? Don't drink any water. Promise me you won't drink any water, okay? She like thro throws her glass out the window. <laughs> Good. Don't drink any more water until either you are well, rescued or killed by these people. I will try to get you out of here, but it won't be tonight. I'm sorry. Who are you? I'm a friend. Kind of. I'm here to help. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Just be quiet. Try to stay safe and don't say anything. Okay? Oh. Okay. 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 And he like backs it into the cat's mouth. <laughs> Closes it back up. She, uh, <laughs> she gets up and walks over to the the balcony door just opens the door so you can go back out again. He's not done yet. Oh, okay. Alright, so I need to mark down those things that I used already so I know what I'm oh, yeah. working with here. So Hispacho is going to uh, keep a uh, vial, that vial of snake venom he had. He's going to keep that handy to apply to his tail in case he needs to use it. But, mm -hmm. uh, does this go upstairs? Yep. Or downstairs? Yep. You can just ask her where everyone is. Hey, so I'm looking for, like, the big legion guy here. Do you know where he would be? He's downstairs in the, uh, the hole. He's gonna peek. He used, <laughs> peek he used to keep me and my husband locked up him. here while he parades him around and insult him. Yeah, he's gonna peek down over the edge again. <laughs> yep. If you look in the, uh, the hole there, he's, like, right there. Alright. Drinking All right. and... Partying. Yeah, his bacho is going to take that grung venom mm -hmm. and he's going to and very, very carefully sprinkle the grung venom on the cat skin. Mm hmm. Hmm. Clever. And he's going to pitter patter down there as a cat. <laughs> can you make another uh, stealth test? Yes, I can. <laughs> uh, or even a performance test. As well, yeah. Oh, oh no! <laughs> oh dear! All right. All right uh, Would you like let to me find his bacho on this map? But so often to... he's further. Know. He's on the second floor. Yeah. You can pull him so, to the first so floor. This really sick-looking cat <laughs> that looks floor. kind of wet comes pitter pattering into the room. <laughs> Oh, the, the stairs down is here. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just this cat comes pittering, pattering down. Yeah. Oh, and hey, cat. Like... And he starts, picks you up, <laughs> starts petting you. Yeah. And the guys, he starts they, to they become very afraid. They're like snuggling. Yeah, as they're all, playing as with they're the all cat. petting him, they all start to get poisoned. <laughs> the guy over here starts shouting at them to stop petting the cat. Fucking kill it. It's dinner. Yeah, the cat like squeezes. Try oh, I'll, uh, if I have to do an athletic or uh, acrobatic or something to pop out, the like, spacho's got to try to pop out of his grip. Like meow. One of them, the the captain here, uh, says, "Hey, that's not a cat." The spacho goes for the neck. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 just just assist. Say meow as loud as you can. Well, uh, well, he's already said uh, it. He's going for the neck. I've already, yeah, I've already failed my, uh, I've already failed my performance check. So, yep. Uh, yep. can I, can I at least get my uh, advantage surprise? On this? Yeah, yeah. He doesn't expect you to try and stab him with with your tail. So, go ahead. 
All right, I right, yeah, I'm going for this guy's neck with the tail stinger. Yeah. Group. Twenty-four. That is a hit. Roll damage. And oh. fifteen damage, and I'm going to give him the venom. Uh, so he has to roll a Constitution saving throw. Target DC is twelve. All right, so he is he. The poison doesn't do anything, but he did take fifteen damage. And as a bonus action, I'm going to cunning action and try to disengage and move away, and head outside. If you can, rub your cat skin on them. I already have been. Like, they've been petting him and picking him up. He, he's, like, at least four or five of these guys are gonna freak out in a minute. <laughs> but before you even get to move away, Ben... Yes. Another guy, like, two of the guys next to him scream and start stabbing the captain as well. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. Yes. <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> Absolute right. chaos. Yes. I love it. All right, so I still have one of those. Oh my god! All right, so yeah. Then as you run going away, to use this opportunity to try to escape, fly up over this area, and oh, get out the window. And yeah. Can get at him. Yeah. Like, that window might be and... too small for you to fit through. Well, either way, his yeah. has enough. There is a door right there. Yeah. Way, yeah. Yeah. Start working his way back over while there's chaos and yeah. people freaking out, stabbing each other in there. <laughs> yeah, the uh, guys all start killing going... each other and fighting. Yeah, Hispacho is going to come over here. Since he's still got the poison on him, uh, Hispacho is going to very carefully try to shed his cat skin. Mm hmm. Somewhere over here. Like, <laughs> chuck it down the well as well. <laughs> no, he doesn't want to chuck it down the well because that there's already poison in it. If they pull up a bucket with an empty cat in it, they're not going to drink the well water. He wants them to make sure that <laughs> yeah. it doesn't look poison they're screwed with. It, yeah, he's going to very carefully, obvious. very carefully try to remove the skin without getting himself poisoned. Mm -hmm. But I have to make a sleight of hand or something. Yeah, I'm go ahead. To do so. Go ahead. All right. Oh, that was with oh. advantage, unfortunately, yeah. but the first roll was still... Uh, I'm fine with that. You can take off all the right, cat yeah. skin and put it on the... Uh, <laughs> the f rub it all over the... Uh... I will actually throw it into the coals, just in case they're still hot. Yeah, well, you can rub it all over everything before you put it in. So when oh, the yeah, guy actually, comes back idea, to use his yeah. tools, you get it on, him, <laughs> on himself. Yeah, I'll well. rub it on the blacksmith's stuff a little bit. Yeah. Nice. He might, he might rub some on the well bucket rope. <laughs> All right, and then he'll toss the skin over here into the into the kiln. Yeah, and uh, he'll put on the uh, weasel skin. Yeah, and he's gonna head back around over here. I imagine after that couple minutes, the chaos in here is—they're all on Metal Gear Solid alert mode. Oh, they're all on Metal Gear Solid alert mode, and they're all getting stabbed. Yeah. All right, he's gonna fly up to the roof and mm -hmm. see if there's anyone up top there. Uh, on the roof of that building? On the roof of this building here, yeah. Yeah. Where uh, the uh, top of the tower was. Uh, do, do, do. that's only the exterior over here. Yes. So he's gonna fly back up and get up into this area and start poking around. There appears to be a ballista, but no one is manning it. Alright. There is there a squad over be... here, like, menacingly shaking their fist at, uh, your like army chapter. Yeah. They're just There's like, like NPCs constantly in a cycling action of yep. just menacingly <laughs> Is there are there like any rain barrels or other buckets that appear to be for water for up here? Uh no. There like, is a barrel like that's water. full of like runoff water, but like you could just like pull the yeah, plug it's out. It's not of it. something that they would probably be drinking. Well they might drink it if they find out the well is poisoned. You can just unplug yeah, it. Not... Yeah, his bot just kind of uncork yeah. it, so it starts dribbling out. Yeah. Uh, he'll also use his tail dagger to cart start like weakening the strings on some of these ballista. Or, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. yeah, you can. So he'll try to avoid breaking it, but when it gets under tension, he wants that thing to snap. In fact, when the uh... I'm in the like wrong. he wants it not to be obvious that it's broken until they start winding it up and it whips. In fact, someone head comes off. up the ladder there. 
your man and he walks past you. Hmm. Uh, have, up I, here. have I somehow eluded his, his game? Oh, he didn't see you because you're a tiny creature. And he's oh, small. Okay. you're like small or tiny. He can't see you anyway. And he just walks past yeah. you and goes up there. Starts looking okay. around. You feel like right. you might get a sneaky shot off if you want to. Yeah, as he was walking past, that'd be actually a good opportunity. Well, you could also use the ballista. I spot you can't use the ballista. Well, it's, it's, it's already primed. Pieces. All you need to do is chuck a bolt in it. Is is it a ballista bolt is ten times my size? But the thing is, like, Hispacho couldn't. You, turn you know this what? Thing There's a bolt it. already in it. It's already ready to go. Is is it aimed at him right now? No, I can't not right now. This. But you can easily just like like nudge it. Make a strength test. See if you can nudge it. Oh boy. Yeah. Like, I I, I I appreciate the DM goading me into this, but Hispacho weighs four pounds. He's not moving a three hundred and fifty pound ballist. <laughs> you, can, you can give it a go and see. You never know. He might roll roll oh, well. Oh, I'll I'll try with disadvantage because I'm a tiny creature. Yeah, okay? yeah. Go I'll on. do that. Go on. Right. Three there. See. <laughs> yeah, you try <laughs> attempt to tiny. nudge it and it, it doesn't move. Yeah. However, like, it dang. is aimed at the big crowd of people. Oh. oh. Climb up on the lever and think about it for a second. You could just release it. <laughs> yeah, he's thinking about it. He's yeah. he's looking at this guy like, hmm, or them, him or them. Uh, he'll hop down and and start crawling yeah. along here, and using this as visual cover, he'll just climb and hop up the wall. You can here. hop in under underneath it and run through it. Yeah. yeah, like crawling underneath it, trying That's, to be sneaky. He starts shouting at yeah. those guys over there, and then comes over here to start climbing yeah, I'm going to apply the uh, snake venom that I have yeah. to my Your blade, tail. Yeah. And I'm going to attempt to sneak attack him from underneath the ballista. Yeah, as he tries to go down the ladder next to it, you can catch him. Yeah, Spotch is just going to leap out and face hugger him really quick. And... Yeah, uh, hang on, let me find his character right. sheet. Yep. I, find his character I rolled sheet. a 20 to hit. I'm looking for his character sheet. Du -du -du. <laughs> Twenty-two hit is a hit. All right. Roll damage. Uh, the snake venom is two d four plus potentially nice. He also has legendary actions. That is twenty-six points of damage. 26 points of damage. Ooh. And then Hispacho is going to, if he gets the opportunity to do so, disengage and fly the hell away. Hi, on. He can, he has legendary actions, which means he can use them out of turn. All right. I'm yeah. Listening. So you do a tiny little bit of damage to him. Yep. <laughs> And he's going to attempt to grapple you. Uh, I'll just do a strength test. All right. <laughs> <laughs> nice. He, so, so Ben, he goes to grapple Hispacho. He catches him, and Hispacho goes, uh-oh. And then he goes, oh, no. And then he falls down the ladder. <laughs> Still holding an empty weasel skin. <laughs> he, he's just gone. He lets go of you. <laughs> He just forgot he was climbing a ladder. He just falls down. All right, roll damage for falling down the ladder. <laughs> clunk, 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 clunk. It's actually quite far down, so... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he just dies in an accident before we even get it. <laughs> just, oh, ow, ow, ow. oh my god. <laughs> oh, fucking love uh, it. His, upon, upon getting released, Despacho is immediately going to try to hide. Yeah. They all go, oh no, he fell down the ladder. <laughs> uh, that's Little Jimmy fell do down the well. well. I didn't want to do that at advantage, I'm sorry, but yeah. that was a 24 from the first pool. So, the is trying to hide under the catapult. Oh yeah, you can easily hide, yeah. Alright, yeah. While they're all distracted, he's going to weaken the rope on the catapult, just like he did with the ballista, so it becomes a death trap to whoever tries to set it tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And then he is going to immediately 
hop down over the edge mm -hmm. and fly away as high as he can out of out of reach out of sight yeah back to camp being satisfied that he has caused a lot of trouble for these people tonight yep they are going to uh not have a good night and that is spacho's adventure today fantastic you did good mate i love his yeah i love his <laughs> i love your antics yeah he's just like I, I was thinking about that and i was like wait a second the cat fur isn't my skin i can pour the poison on myself <laughs> <laughs> what do cats do brush up against people's legs get pet by them <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Uh, that that was real clever, I gotta admit. Fantastic. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> then like Edis is like fucking injured now. <laughs> he broke his leg. <laughs> <laughs> injured, poisoned. Oh. Having a bad night. Siege weapons are potentially just going to hurt their users. I'm poison water. In the yeah. middle of siege. Well, I had um, things ready for you to use yeah. the siege weapons if you wanted to, but he kept them away. <laughs> so never yeah, mind. Uh, like, uh, yeah, I, I'm his pacho is like way too small to try to use siege weapons, but he can kind of cut up the ropes a little bit. Uh, following like, warning, you awaken to hear noises of battle in the distance. Oh shit! Ah, dear me, mm, that be bacon. Oh, I just, I just, I just, I just realized that boss had to go. Yeah. See, unfortunately. Yep. Would you like to do the battle now, or wait till next time? It has been two hours and fifteen minutes since we started, so that depends on how long you want the session to be. I'm indifferent. I do we need to pee. Though. Oh, what was that? Yeah, I also have to take a quick break. Yeah. yeah. So you could take a break, start the battle, and then see how the motivation carries us. Yeah. You could always yeah. pause the stream, or rather the video, and yeah. then do a second recording and either add it on to the end of this one, or save it for the next one. Yeah. And how it goes. You know what? Uh, we can probably just wrap it up here, and then boss will be here next time. That sounds like a good. Idea. Yeah. Yeah. As, uh, Let's do it, Ashley. Yeah, let me just, like, kick the bot, because I can't hear anything right now. <laughs> With the sound of battle. We got all the prep <laughs> done. Now all we need is the crusade, the crusade and the cavalry. Oh, the crusade's already happening. <laughs> they started without you. <laughs> I guess Nothing. you could very briefly have us get to the, the forest before we leave, because I'll take five minutes. It'll take place. another day. All right. Yeah. They, they've been here two days, and you're on a three-day journey. Alright, so we'll be, what, a day late before the battle? You'd, you'll probably arrive in the middle of a battle. Alright. Yeah. That works. You know what? Roll a D3. <laughs> Roll a random encounter. Roll a D3, Stu, to see if you can shorten the amount of time that the trip is by just riding through the night. You know what? That's really good. You arrive now. Yay! With the <laughs> talent. Yay! Um, I'll, I'll just say to Will, uh, I were here, pal. Uh, I guess now you better go see your troops. and uh, I'd say get them out of here. Probably safest if you do that and take them to... Uh, your lands go, uh, go be a be your own boss of your own people for a bit. There you go. And I'll you come go. find you again someday. Sound good? Would you, would you like to say anything yeah. to Antanan as he's right there? All oh, right. <laughs> no, no, I was gonna say, um, do this before riding into camp. Oh, I okay, outside the camp. Them. Okay, yeah, I reckon I... they're doing this far outside the camp, yeah. considering. Yeah. Because it would be a bad idea to just ride that together. Yeah. <laughs> you can if you want. Turn them over. I mean, hmm. What do you want, Will? I'm I'm suggesting to you, let's... You go find your boys and get them out of here. That's your own homeland. I'm hiding in a tree. Are you not even going to see your own men first? <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. 
I will see my men if I have to. Yeah. Well, but, well, yeah. Oh, yeah. If I have to. What was <laughs> left of them, anyway? They're still there. They're just bored as fuck. <laughs> I'm looking trees. Pretty sure they got killed earlier on, but okay. The battle has not begun. Yeah. The battle has begun. Well, the yeah. crusade has begun. The siege hasn't begun. Our involvement has not yet begun. True. Oh, you hear trebuchets go off in the background. Hang on. Hang on. Uh, two trebuchets go off. Uh, and they fucking miss completely. Is that well, a Will, do you actually want to go into camp, or do you want to just go find your man and get out of here? I don't mind. But it's your choice. <laughs> it's up to you, Will. You can decide what you do. My recommendation is go check on your men, because they and you might need it if you want to have any men left. Erica sees you, by the way, because you're like right there, and uh, she rolled a. Well, I rolled a 15. Mm hmm. I don't know what her uh, wisdom modifier is, but she definitely sees you. Okay. What do you want to do, Will? <laughs> should I stay or should I go? <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. My plan roll a dice to... if you can't decide. If you're not going to decide, roll a dice. dice. Yeah, roll a dice. Roll a d two, Will, and if it's a uh, one, you go into oh, the camp. But if it's a uh, a two, you run two away. Do you know to roll a d two? Roll a one. Nope. Roll a oh, one. No, just no, David choose back home. Forget it. Yeah. <laughs> no, you just leave. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I can't be it's probably. I, I just say like, I'll yeah. I'll find you later. You know, good luck being a boss, a young fan. I was gonna help in the battle, but it doesn't matter. Are you taking your uh, horse with you? Nah, I'll leave a horse for you guys. Oh, okay. you should. No, you should take it with you, man. It's a good horse. Mm. Like... <laughs> you went. You went to the effort to get <laughs> yeah, a horse. You guys, the guy's not gonna need it anymore. Kind of horse. <laughs> Fine, I'll keep a horse. Yeah. Which one was it's it? The, the brown kind of horse. They say one? rental. <laughs> That one. Oh yeah, the the paint. Yeah. There you go. Stu's horse is there. Yeah, boy. Horsey, my horse face. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Yeah, oh, that's... perfect. There he is. Wow, he's got oh, 13. Oh, that's just the the generic one. I can swap it to the brown one later. Yeah, right. If you prefer the brown one, or you can keep just the gray one. Just pitch it somewhere. Yeah. Be like, boys, boys, is it begun? Am I too late? Oh, yeah, you hear the battle in the distance. <laughs> ah, hola. Hello, Remy. Hang on, let me, let me Hello, boys, play it. how's it going? Uh, well, um, the crusade has started before us. We'll um, come in after. All right. Well, let's get this uh, finished before those crusader lads uh, show up to claim all the glory, eh? True. Um, before then, do you want some rabbit bacon? Oh, like what? <laughs> so I'm like rabbit having bacon. breakfast and watching the battle. <laughs> All right, yeah. But yeah, sure. If you got big gabba It's just like people dying, just like having some gabba Don't mind if you do. <laughs> just a quick one though, because I got an idea. Uh, is there a wall, a gatehouse? Hmm. It's Basho. You you've been. There's the gatehouse, I poisoned all the water, got a bunch of people with fear poison and they started killing each other and the wards are pretty much decimated. Perfect, oh, perfect, awesome. Yeah. Did yeah. you say fear poison? Where'd you get that? No. Hmm. I got it I got it from a guy. Fair fair. That's good. Listen, to me. my it's tools of the trade, you know. Subtle oh. things. But anyway. Yeah, all you gotta know is the orgs are not going to be a problem. And the water is poisoned and people who drink it are going to die. And a bunch of people got afraid and stabbed each other. And the... Oh yeah, I also got their commander in the leg and then he fell down a ladder and it broke his leg. 
And, uh, yeah. Oh, beautiful. Off their ballistas. I cut the ropes on their ballistas, too. Nice. Excellent. <laughs> Speaking of which, the ballista goes off and, like, hits the mic. No. <laughs> Everything just nice. fucking breaks. Well, hey, there it goes. So, oh, I dude. suppose uh, you, you know what to repair when it's yours again, eh? I just cut the ropes. It's mm -hmm. exactly. all it was. So when they go off, they go snap, and then someone gets his head ripped off, he gets his leg ripped off, he gets a rope burned, he sides up in Baku, you know, it's good stuff. No, I, I did not mean that uh, in in a negative manner. I very much appreciate it. Just make sure you, uh, you replace it once we've taken over. It's just a rope, man. You can buy a rope. It's like cheap. Suddenly Rosa Everybody starts has cheering. Everybody feet of rope in this universe. Suddenly Rosa starts cheering as if like her team scored a goal. <laughs> <laughs> fucking ballista Wee! or the trebuchet just like destroys on the tower. Wee! Oh beautiful. Alright. Hey well, fellas, you, you wanna join the battle or watch it uh, play out for a Yeah, bit? Zad is like I hope my wife wasn't in that tower. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. Fair. Hey guys, um, try to aim at like the gate. It's yes. gonna be power. Better late than never, I suppose. Oh, uh, Pasta gave the trebuchets away to the, to the Spanish. Yes. Oh, he's, he's, he's still like, hey man, try to aim it at the gate so we can get in there. Oh, I can't get to the trebuchet, it's underneath everything. <laughs> there we go. Uh, uh, yes, I, uh, I gave it, considering we don't have a very experienced personnel. Yeah. I'm sorry. But, uh, before we get carried away, I do think we should wait for boss to, mm -hmm. to carry on from here. <laughs> I like to yeah. think that she was just watching Altana just arrive and then leave again. She just didn't care. Yeah. She just continued yeah, brooding. Because she's invisible, it's... so you can't see her. <laughs> <laughs> I want okay. to brood in peace with these corpses. <laughs> Like, his Pacho just, like, goes there and does his business on the corpses as usual. <laughs> She's just lying on the just pile of corpses. watching him poop. Like. Yeah. <laughs> Lydia, call. The troops are yours. Gentlemen. It's time to fight. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like, <laughs> finally. <laughs> and he starts riding off. Yeah, his bot chose to hang on Hector. The Star Trek thing. Yeah. I'm just imagining, so, uh, as Hector Fidus is saying that, he just takes one last bit of, like, rabbit bacon as he has, as he's walking. Sips his wine glass of tequila. Yeah! Sips the tequila, takes some rabbit uh, bacon, and just keeps walking towards the battle. And toss it to the side. Alright. And yeah. fate When we, uh, for the, for the battle, like, Hispacho's gonna be on Hector's shoulder or nearby at all. Nice. But, yeah, I think if we stop here, that'd be for the best. So yeah. Boss can at least be a part of the next one. There appears to be two people missing. No, there appears to be one person missing. Oh, yeah, because the captain is right here. Yeah, like, like, like now is just the time for like, okay, how do you want your character to like, dramatically enter the battle? <laughs> well, go towards the battle, I guess. There, there is no order, they just charged in. <laughs> Way! <laughs> All charged <laughs> <laughs> Alright then. Wait, Lydia, is this your troops? <laughs> what was that? No, I, I'm kidding. Just the last bit of comedy. Oh yeah, yeah. Th those were Lydia's uh, men that got the orcs in the plate. Yeah, no, no wonder they didn't uh, just wandered in. Yeah. Oh, they all got in formation before they ra ran in. Okay, that's good. Yep. Any final messages before we end it here? Don't drink the water. Do. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Don't trust rabbits. Rabbits mm. must burn. Either to bacon or burn in hell. Mm -hmm. uh, snitches get drowned. Oh, oh. In two inches of water. Empty <laughs> 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 water. 
You should have practiced your push-ups, pal. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that the uh, a certain character was left visible to the players. <laughs> no. Hmm. Yeah. Dun dun dun. Wait, what? Dun. I haven't seen this. Yeah. Dun, dun. It was. It's on the list. I I forgot to make it invisible to players. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah. Is he missing a foot? He better be missing a foot because I took his foot and I fed it to my dog. Stu also took his ears. Yeah, like he beats his just like a mess. <laughs> it's got like peg ears and peg leg. And... Yep. Ross, well, if Beats doesn't have peg ears, I will be really disappointed. <laughs> it's just duct tape in the shape of ears. It's like like bar stool legs sticking out of his head where his ears would be because <laughs> pirates. Oh god. <laughs> there there is many things that Baka can do that you don't know about. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, One of them is probably heal his missing ears and missing leg. Oh well, it's like it's like that that great meme where it's like uh, you know resurrection restores like removed body parts and stuff like that, and then yeah. just like the D and D official art of like a guy resurrecting somebody, they added a voice balloon that just says, "This will uncircumcise you." <laughs> All right. Good night, everybody. Good night, everyone. Bye bye.